I'm on the way to see one of my old clients here in Darwin. I haven't seen her for around 12 months. Last time we were training together, she didn't want to put on any extra weight, was her main goal. We did lose a little. This time, we're hoping to get her down under the 100 kilo mark and into some Levi's. We're gonna set some new goals, some new techniques, and really get her on track. My name's Serena, I'm 41 years old, going on 42. Um, I run a bridal shop in Darwin called The Big Day and own it as well, um, and that keeps me quite busy. Uh, with bridal wear in Darwin, it is very, very seasonal, so you'll find that uh, for six months of the year, you're absolutely crazy mental flat out, and for the other six, you're sitting there twiddling your thumbs. So for those six months where it's really, really busy, um, you tend to overeat and get really, really slack with, with your diet and exercise and all that sort of stuff. Mm. Well, the wet season is when you know it's time to party and go fishing and take time off. And so it sort of works both ways. When it's busy, you don't have time for your diet. When it's not busy, you tend to party a bit harder and you know do lots of things that you shouldn't because you can. Mm. <laughs> Just recently went to Brisbane to catch up with a girlfriend and she took me shopping, which I love shopping. But it's always for shoes because I know you know I can find a size 10 or 11 or 12 that might fit. But uh, to try and find some clothes that fit was really, really quite depressing. And I had to walk around DFO for you know, about half an hour to 45 minutes before I found a fat chick store. And even then, uh, I've got an outfit that I just loved. I had to buy it, but I knew that I had to put panels in it. So I put eight inches of extra fabric into an extra, extra large fat chick top already. And it was really, really depressing. After meeting with Serena, I've devised an exercise program for her or she'll be training three times a week with myself and the onus will be on her to train three times a week by herself. I'm also going to help educate her about healthy lifestyle choices, healthy food choices and how these will affect her weight loss journey. When I was designing Serena's program, I made sure I included many functional movements. These exercises not only help you lose weight fast, they also help you perform your everyday activities with a lot more ease. On the day Serena's not training with me, she walks on her treadmill. On the weekends, however, she gets outside and enjoys the sunshine. If you are exercising in a hot climate such as Darwin, it is advisable to keep well hydrated at all times. Please take water with you and drink it whenever you can. Uh, well, hopefully by the end of the year, around Christmas time, maybe, maybe January, I'll be able to fit in a pair of Levi's to go to the Tamworth music, uh, Country Music Festival with a girlfriend. Uh, that's a major goal, but I hope to make a lot of smaller ones through through the year. Um, and obviously, you know, just, just to feel really, really good about who I am and what I do and just to wake up every morning with lots of energy. That's all we have for this week of Serena's journey. Join us next week when we check up on Serena's progress, take an in-depth look at her diet and really ramp up her exercise regime. We look forward to seeing you then.